Welcome along Speedway fans, yet another meeting at ZM Miani Speedway the 27th of December, nice to have you along. Tonight of course the DHL Speed Week Series, that's saloons of course, and uh, running over seven nights in a row these guys. Tonight the third night and uh, they're here at Miani Speedway. Also tonight 20 TQs, so it should be a goodie, sit back and enjoy. Welcome, Welcome race, race fans, here we are once again at the ZM Miani Speedway. We've got something special for you tonight. Very shortly, we've got uh, three people coming out of that plane. We've got Andy Pine. He's done over 8,500 jumps. Also, Lawrence Moat. He's going to have the Go Fast canopy. Got the sponsors on that one. And also, we've got a lady up there, Kate Wills. 3,000 plus jumps. She's got the blue, black and white parachute. We've also got the support people down here on the ground as well. Hamish Carmichael. He's the man coordinating the, vi the event. Tony Harding's there as well. And also young Kelly here, she's only eight years old. Got to have those support crews. The orange flag signifies all is okay on the ground. That's why they started jumping. We don't see it very much here at ZM Miani Speedway. It's a bit of a treat for you. Proudly sponsored by Go Fast Sports Drinks. That's the F Athletics Energy Drink. www.gofast.co.nz. Check out Andy. They said he had the sports car shoot on. He's coming down real quick. His shoes are smoking. It'll take them about three to five minutes to get down on the ground. It looks like it's only going to take Andy maybe less than two. There's a lot of manoeuvrability with these shoots. Left and right hands pulling on those toggles. Just check it out. Wow, he's coming down fast. And he'll slow that right down. Look at that. Well done. Big round of applause for Andy. That's Andy Pine, ladies and gentlemen. Over eight and a half thousand jumps. The go fast shoot up there, Lawrence Mowat. And of course, Kate Wills. Kate's done 3,000 plus jumps. Well, very much looking forward to the Danzas DHL Saloon Series. And of course, Caddy Shack himself is here, Steve Williams, the Cloud Nine skydiving crew. Here comes the second one in. Lawrence Mowat, a little off the mark. Oh, that's why they do it for the sheer adrenaline rush. Big round of applause there for Lawrence. And now we've just got Kate Wills up there. Kate's done 3,000 plus jumps. It's looking pretty controlled up there. And here comes Kate, just about on the ground now. Looking very, very controlled. Like I say, a lot of manoeuvrability in these things. And here comes Kate. Big round of applause there for Kate Wills. Fantastic stuff from the Go Fast Sports crew. Cloud Nine skydiving. If you want to learn to skydive, you can go tandem. Just call him 0800 go jump. Well, we're we'll just trying to get a quick word with Andy. Andy, over eight and a half thousand jumps, mate, and you mustn't be getting sick of it. You must love the adrenaline buzz. Yeah, I don't know whether you realise that, but I just had a problem with my main canopy, and that was my reserve parachute, so I just got rid of the main and used option two. Is, is that what we saw way up there when it just separated and. Right, so uh, what, what goes through your mind when that happens? Ah, uh, yeah, well, uh, that's what you. Adrenaline is basically pumping, you just do the job, you know, it's like, put it this way, it's the equivalent with that sort of parachute of having a blowout at about um, 200 kilometres an hour, you just have to deal with it. Uh, it looked like you were coming down pretty quick in about the last 20 feet, you just slowed it right down. What sort of speed would you do, be doing just before that 20 feet? Um, with the reserve parachute, it was um, a different configuration. My normal parachute, I'd come in very fast forward. This one, I copped a bit of wash coming over the trees, there's a bit of wind up there and it's like white water going over rocks so you would have noticed we all bounced about a bit at the last few feet and uh, yeah it just makes it a bit of a challenge which is uh, why a jump like this isn't just a normal skydive uh, if we're jumping on our normal drop zone if you come down and do a tandem with us for example you'll see we're it's a lot bigger area less obstacles around but um, that's what display jumping is all about getting the adrenaline pumping well done Andy once again a big round of applause for the crew 